YouTube, how's it going? This is Ace with your one-stop gaming hookup. If you haven't already subscribed and you're new to the channel, make sure you do that and turn notifications on and be sure to slap that like button. Now before I hop into the details about how to unlock this hidden nuke score streak, the gameplay in the background, I go 26 and 0, almost hit the nuclear medal. We did get the brutal medal, but we ran out of time in the game, unfortunately. Now I haven't gotten the nuclear medal, but I've seen other people obtain the medal, and the kills from your score streaks do count towards your kill medals. Unlike recent Call of Duties that only counted your gun kills. This is pretty cool, I think. Kind of reminds me of Modern Warfare 2. Now I'm not sure if the kills from your score streaks are gonna count towards this hidden nuke score streak which is rumored to be the v2 rocket now with all that being said let's go ahead and hop into this video and get into the details huh at this point this is a rumor and it's from several sources and what they're stating the way to unlock this hidden nuke score streak again rumored to be called the v2 rocket score streak not sure exactly what the name is going to be and the way to do that is you're going to have to prestige all of your division squads four times each once you do this that's going to unlock the hidden nuclear score streak we all want a nuke score streak in the game so bad even if you don't ever get one i mean come on how awesome would it be to see your favorite map look like this And let me stress, guys, again, this is rumored. It's yet to be 100% confirmed, but it's coming from solid sources. And Michael Condry, the head developer over at Sledgehammer Games, did reply to a tweet, and it happened to be from Swag XBL, who questioned, is there going to be a nuke score streak? I mean, we're all excited. We want to grind for something special and michael condry did reply pretty much hinted there is going to be a nuke score streak but it's not going to be easy to get and boy it makes sense that you have to prestige the divisions four times each one of them to unlock this score streak now you're probably asking why should i prestige each one of my divisions four times because you're saying there's a hidden nuke score streak well again it's coming from pretty solid sources. But let's look at the worst case scenario. Let's say there's no hidden nuke score streak. Well, let's put it this way. You still earn some pretty awesome stuff for prestiging your division. Each time, you're going to get a reward. And the rewards are as follows. The first time you prestige your division, you're going to receive a weapon associated with that particular division. The second division prestige, you will receive a special calling card. It's probably going to be pretty cool and animated, so I'm looking forward to checking that out. The third division prestige, you're going to receive an outfit for that division. And the fourth and final prestige, you're going to receive an epic weapon variant for the weapon you first unlocked on the first prestige for the division. Also, guys, just want to point this out. The rumor does state you're going to be required to max out the rank for each division before unlocking that secret nuke score streak. It's not going to be easy, but it's going to be fun once you get it and it's going to be very rewarding. And that kind of seems like what Sledgehammer Games went for throughout the entire multiplayer experience. They want to create a challenging environment, but it's very rewarding, you know? You have those games where you just keep dying, and you're trying to figure out, what can I do to get my score streaks? Once you actually obtain them, it's a very good feeling, and they're very fun to use, you know? Even simple score streaks like the Pilot Fighter or the Glide Bomb, they're so fun to use. So just imagine how amazing this nuke score streak is going to be. I'm sure they put a a lot of work into it and i'm looking forward to actually seeing it in action well guys i hope you enjoyed the video i wanted to make it short sweet and simple and i hope you're as excited as i am because i was really disappointed to not see a nuclear gun streak in the game with this rumor being out there it gives us some hope it gives us something else to grind for. It's going to be a fun Call of Duty year. And this is just the beginning. Imagine what else they're going to be adding. I mean, this is exciting, guys. But again, thanks for stopping by. Make sure you subscribe for future videos and streams. And please slap the like button. It does help us grow as a channel. As always, it's been a pleasure. And I'll see you in the next video. I'm out.